What's the letter? What's the letter? What's the letter? The letter of the bell. Yeah. The letter of the Vlogging um, culture is remembering to that you started a clip in landscape and not turning it vertical. Anyways, getting ready to go to work. I have to put like actual pants on. I haven't worn pants in like four days. I've just been wearing shorts. Like shorts is shorts. Shorts and slides are my. It's my lifestyle. But now I have to put like my legs and jeans. I love you. All right. I'll miss you. Hey. Hey. Right. Okay. Bye. Can never be too safe. Can never be too safe. I'm going to Pete's Coffee. I'm uh, gonna get some coffee. Uh, probably something iced. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out when we get there. I'm trying to find where my mom and aunt went. I can't find them. I'm like a lost child. Please, if you see them, let me know. Um, they are right here. Oh my gosh, I found them. They, <laughs> I, I went into Trader Joe's looking for you and I couldn't find you. Okay, so... I, um... Wait... No, right. but still, I'm gonna be walking behind the car like that. Okay, so you saw your aunt, you did see Yeah, I saw her. She was in line, uh -huh. and so I go to get behind her in line because she was almost done. And so as I'm walking up to the line, I'm standing there. This other cashier takes this woman's big cart and puts it right in front of me oh. and cuts me off in line so that lady with the big cart could go first. And I was like. And you had one thing? I had two things. I, I got a uh, kombucha and the pressed juice. And what did you say? I was just sitting there like, my my white woman privilege did not work at that time. I was really upset. I was just like, save it for the vlog. Save it for the content. We need content. Alright? But um, if, that, if the lady sees this, which she probably won't, um, you're a bitch and we all know it. <laughs> I've never, I've never tried this kombucha before, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna dig on in to this one. Uh, um, taste test. They didn't taste like watermelon. It tastes like sugar water. But it just tastes weird. It's not bad. Now why would you get it? It's a little different. It's different. You see. Yeah, this uh, kombucha, it, um, it definitely does not mix well with ice coffee. <laughs> I got this pressed juice from Trader Joe's. It is watermelon as well. I'm not like a huge watermelon fan, but I do like watermelon. Alright, if that makes sense. Like, I'm not like hard pressed over watermelon. Yeah, because they're right next to each other. And so I'm going to do a taste test of this one. Only two ingredients in here. It says two pounds of watermelon and one half and one fourth lemon. It said two pounds. Yeah. Goodness. Yep. But we're we're gonna try it and see how we like it. All right. For the culture. I would give that a six out of ten. Actually, maybe like a seven out of ten because it's not bad. It, it is pretty refreshing. But I should have waited until I didn't have coffee in my mouth, like coffee taste, but it's still pretty good. So we made it to Silver Diner. We're gonna eat. I'm gonna eat. 
I'm gonna eat so so well. Oh, All right, I'll hold it for you. I did not want to be in your picture. Okay, well, so my mom doesn't want to be in my vlog, but I'll. Oops, oops, we got a wide. Oops, I can't control my hands whenever I'm filming. Oops. Anyways, we made it. I'm hungry. I'm gonna get something with breakfast food as per usual because breakfast food is the only food that makes me happy internally and deep down in my soul along with a lot of other foods but we're, uh, breakfast food is the way to go for everything in my opinion all right thank you they, they don't even have food up in here how am I supposed to get loose they don't have boot up in here. Don't they know summer 18? That's the song song of the summer. This is this is unbelievable. I can't. I'm over it. I don't wanna wait for my lives to be over. Anyways. She's here. She's looking good. She's looking extra thick. Damn ma. Uh, woo! Haha. Uh -huh. You like it when I do that, don't you? You dirty bitch. I'm so excited. Uh, thanks, Silver Diner. That was great. I ate too much. But, you know, what are you gonna do? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Uh, I guess I'm on my way to work. I know. I, I, I enjoyed spending this time with you. You know, talking to you, going on little errands with you. But I have to go to work, you know. I have to be like an adult. This year is a so for diner, uh, you completed my my life and I appreciate you for that. So when I get to work, I guess I'll talk to you later. Boom. Alright, so life update. I uh, ended up leaving work early um, because I threw up. Not once, but twice. I threw up um, all that amazing food that I had at the Silver Diner. Um, before I left Silver Diner, uh, my stomach was feeling kind of weird. It was, it was, I mean, the food was awesome, but once I got into the car, even my mom said that she felt weird. But uh, So I get to work, working hard. My stomach starts rumbling. I'm like, oh shit. Like, it's going down. So then I realized I need to... Like get to the bathroom. So I spent like five minutes in the bathroom even before I started work. Um, get to work, end up running to the stall, and end up um, just throwing out everything I ate. I feel like 18 pounds lighter, but I can't go back to work now for like a day and a half. Uh, but what can you do? Uh, that's just to make sure that it's not foodborne illness or anything. Um, so I end up walking, well, catching a couple buses home, um, and now here we are. So, I decided that I was going to tell you guys, well, actually, okay. Well, I feel a lot better now after having gone through all that, but I decided that I was going to tell two stories about, um, me throwing up, other than the one I just told. Was. Uh, excuse me. In my 12th grade year, um, I was a little ridiculous. I had down an entire bottle of rubber and I went to class. <laughs> it's just so fucking stupid. I don't, I drank the whole thing and I, I went to class and, um, I'm starting to feel a little woozy because as you know, like, if you've done it before, the come up is like crazy and it, your stomach starts hurting and, and it's really ridiculous. So I get to class, I'm on, I'm on, I'm coming up, I get to about 30, 30 minutes, 45 minutes into class, I raise my hand, I go, uh, excuse me, teacher, I need to use the bathroom right away, like, right now. She goes, okay, so I go, to, I go, grab the hall pass, go to the bathroom. I go into the bathroom, and immediately, as soon as I open the door, I just, like, projectile vomit, exorcist style, purple Robitussin bullshit all over the bathroom floor, and I just felt so bad, I was the only one in there too, I felt so bad, 
And I was like, holy shit. So I, I, I leave the bathroom. And I see the hall monitor coming down the hall. And I'm like, fuck. Like, let me just hurry up and get back to class. I drank a little bit of water. Went, ran back to class. As soon as I get back into the classroom, um, one of my classmates raises their hands. And, they, and she, she says, hey, um, can, can, you, can you use the bathroom as well? And so I give her the hall pass. And I'm like, wait, 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 wait. Before you go in there, somebody threw all over the bathroom floor. And everybody was looking at me like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> it, 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 it was me. And if you were the classmate who saw that, I'm so sorry that you had to walk into that. Um, the things we do to get high. But anyways, uh, I guess that's it for this vlog. I hope that you liked it. Uh, if you did, uh, give it a thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe below. Or like, comment, subscribe, wherever, on YouTube. Shout out to my job for making sure that I was okay. And, uh, that's it. But, um, just, uh, one, one thumbs up, one like, equals one prayer. So pray for me. And I will see you guys later.